Hi, this is Peep Sotney with Colorado Home Sales Inc. and welcome to our Tuesday morning market updates. So uh, we do look at six counties every morning on Tuesday and we try to inform our audience of what's going on with the inventory levels. We're looking at Adams County, um, Adams, Arapaho, Denver, Douglas, Elbert, and Jefferson County. Those are the counties that I typically sell in. Uh, so those are the ones that I'm always looking at data. So we have some good news. Uh, we've met market demand two times in the last two weeks. And that means that we actually have an increase in active listings. So uh, this morning we had 2,055 active listings. This is the first time we've been over 2,000 in several weeks. Uh, that's a variance of 190 listings from last week. Uh, so we are starting to move in the right direction, but we're still a far cry from the 10,000 listings that we really need to kind of start slowing this market down a little bit. So buyers, I know you've been really frustrated for the last three months. Um, but unfortunately, the market is still really tight. And if you're buying in those popular areas, the west side of town, Lakewood, Littleton, Arvada, Wheat Ridge, um, if you're buying downtown, uh, you're still seeing multiple offers in the tune of 10 to 15 offers on a property. And you're likely having to go 30 to $50,000 over asking and probably having to put some provisions into your contracts like appraisal gap coverage, meaning you're gonna agree to pay the difference between contract price and an appraisal. Um, certainly message me if you want more information on that. Uh, the million dollar market, it's going from uh, 467 listings last week. It bumped up to 489. So that is also meeting market demand. And uh, we saw an increase or a variance of 22 listings. Um, still a far cry from 1,200. And uh, as we get into this, the close area, I'll show you how we only really have one month of inventory in the million dollar plus market. Um, our pending listings. So these are listings that are under contract or currently in contract. Uh, as of this morning, we had 7,728. Doesn't mean all these are gonna go um, and be sold, but that is the market demand, or at least how many homes we're currently tying up. So we really are tying up 7,728, that's almost 8,000 listings, and we only have 2,000 listings to pick from. Um, so that's really where your frustration is coming from as a buyer, is you're having to be that competitive to get something under contract. Um, that is an increase from last week, so that market demand is still going up. Uh, that's a variance of 158 listings from what we saw last week. And the, mark, uh, the million dollar market, it's kind of doing the same thing. It went from 634 uh, pending listings up to 641. That's a variance of seven. Uh, so our million dollar listings are still selling. Um, and if you are trying to list your million dollar home, let me tell you why you should. Um, we always look at solds and that's kind of like our main market demand of what sold in the last 30 days. Yes, it's nice that 7,000 homes are currently pending, but probably only about three or 4,000 of those are actually gonna result in sales. Other ones will come back onto the market. But we did sell 5,351 in the last 30 days. Um, that is an increase uh, from last week. That's a variance of 117 homes. Um, as I've been kind of talking about my channel, typically, traditionally, we sell about six to 7,000 homes in the month of June and July, uh, May and June. Uh, so that we are getting really close to what our market demand was back in 2018 and 2019. The only difference is, is in 2018 and 19, we had 10 to 12,000 homes available at this time of year. Right now, we got 2,055. So um, until those numbers get more into balance, we are gonna see market increases and we're not in a bubble. This is actually supply and demand driving our price points. So um, that's a big conversation that's always out there. And uh, I truly believe that our market is gonna continue to increase until we get to at least 30 to 40,000 homes of inventory. The million dollar market, and this is kind of that big story I was talking about earlier. Currently, in the last 30 days, we sold 485 million dollar listings. We currently have active 489. So that's almost exactly one month of inventory. Um, that's traditionally a six to 12 month inventory type of market. So usually when you list your house, it takes you six to 12 months to sell it. Right now, it only really takes you 30 days to sell that house. And honestly, if you're between like 1 million and 1.5 million, there's a good chance you're gonna sell it on your opening weekend and probably get some multiple offers because that market is really that tight. So if you're looking at selling high end, now's a great time to do that as well. Um, continue watching our Tuesday morning market updates. We're gonna be here next week. We're kind of starting to watch this inventory level rise. So hopefully the market will start slowing down for you guys as buyers. And I'm here every Tuesday morning to inform you. Uh, so please do like our Facebook page and subscribe to our YouTube channel and continue watching our Tuesday morning market updates. Thanks.